Robo Papa. Hey YouTube, this is Robo Papa, and today I'm just trying to show you like something very small that I did. Um, just a fun project for if you have kids and um, you like to show them how electronic works. So I printed up a little droid Android um, symbol from the 3D printer and I was thinking well this is pretty cool you know there's like some cavity over here that I can use and you know something with the eyes and kind of like the mouth and I was like hey you know what I can do something for for my kids and show them how electronics kind of work um, in a high level I mean they're still too young to to see everything but it can be a fun project so I was thinking what if I'll just have like two LED lights on the on the eyes and three on the mouth that will just rotate back and forth um, working with some uh, battery and you know it will be pretty nice so what I created is basically this kind of design as you can see there's the LED um, for the eyes over here they're the yellow and then I have three LEDs for the the mouth and in order for it to go back and forth I had to have some small brain for it so I created the AT Tiny 85 which is a very nice um, IC controller kind of like a mini Andrino that you can use and it's pretty powerful um, you're probably wondering what is this big wide blob over here well the battery that I'm using is an external battery um, it's really just to charge your phones uh, but you can still use it, it gives like a very nice uh, output it's coming with uh, 5 volts for 1.5 amps let me see if I can zoom in a little bit on this uh, yeah I guess it's hard to read, well I guess you will need to trust me um, and yeah it's it's pretty nice um, the problem is because it's uh, for the phone, the phone usually having small charge on them or small load and that's what this resistor is causing it's creating the small load that way the battery will stay on so all you do is really just coming in the back like so fitting into the eyes and the mouth and when you're ready you can just plug it into the battery and there you go and now you have kind of freaky Arduino little doll it's pretty nice um, I can post the schematics and the code that I wrote to um, go back and forth, the dude LED going back and forth but I just wanted to share with you something small that I did um, the, the build is fairly simple um, obviously you need to have resistors for the LEDs which are over here and they're similar um, resistance to the AT Tiny I'm not using pin number one because it's for the reset obviously pin number eight and number four is for the positive and ground and then I have all the other GPIOs for um, the lights and then you can connect it from here for a um, battery power and then in the back just soldering it pretty straightforward kind of fun project to do with kids if you have uh, older kids that can solder and you know you can build it with them so hope you like it um, please subscribe and like and if you have any questions uh, let me know I'll post a link to my website with the schematics and the code for the AT Tiny um, so let me know if you have any questions thanks